is becoming more advanced every year and requires a training program like Mercer's to educate and prepare future automotive technicians in the ever-changing industry. The need for proficient technicians is increasing. There's more and more people retiring that have solid skills in the industry and the business, because cars are technologically advanced nowadays, you really do need formal training. You need college level training to succeed in this industry. Hi, I'm Melissa and I'm here today to talk to you about the College Automotive Program, otherwise known as CAP, here at Mercer. The CAP program here at Mercer County Community College began in 1986 as the Chrysler Dealer Apprenticeship Program. And we started with the idea of bringing the uh, manufacturer, in that time Chrysler Corporation, Chrysler Motors Corporation, and Mercer County Community College together with the intention of training students to become technicians in the Chrysler Dodge and at that time Plymouth dealerships. With the Chrysler CAT program, it gives you the chance to become a certified automotive technician. Do you like working outside of the classroom? Do you like working with your hands? Do you love working on cars? Then the Mercer Automotive Program has got you covered with extensive training in eight major areas of automotive repair. I decided to go to this program because I do a lot of automotive work and it's a good program. Gets you set up for a job. Dealerships look at the type of training you have for a good amount of money. I decided to join the CAP program because I love working on automobiles and I'm pretty much guaranteed a job upon graduation. What's great about the program is that you learn from the textbook, you learn the theory behind it, and then you go out in the shop and you take it apart. So I've learned, from my experiences, I've learned how to apply my knowledge, diagnose and repair a vehicle. The reason I attended uh, Mercer's program was I realized that if I just stayed in the facility that I was working and I never obtained uh, a scholastic background or a degree background, I could never leave the position had I want to or if I desire to later in life. And so much of the decisions when you're a young person, you don't realize the impact of your decisions from 18 to 23, that by obtaining a degree, it's permitted me to become a high school teacher and uh, share my passion for the automotive community to well over 350 students. This program is very good for students who have an interest in automotive. Automotive is no longer the backyard mechanic. Uh, many people take for granted um, when they take their car to a, a dealership that they're paying the high dollar repair bill because there is a lot of technology and education that goes into training a service technician. Mercer offers two programs that students can study, the Chrysler College Automotive Program and the Comprehensive Automotive Program. Students enrolled in the CAT program will be exposed to training material furnished by Chrysler LLC and be trained on Chrysler-specific vehicle platforms. CAT students will be required to complete Chrysler classroom instruction and computer-based training in addition to fulfilling internship requirements at any Chrysler Dodge or Jeep dealership. A regular day at the CAT program basically consists of running uh, class time activities. Could include lecture time in a classroom setting. Uh, usually it includes uh, mostly lab activities where students actually get hands-on experience and uh, learn on real-world vehicles and real-world experiences that they might see at a dealership or repair facility. The CAB program is an Associate of Applied Science degree program that includes 11 automotive related courses supported by eight academic classes and a minimum of five required internships at a Chrysler dealership. The facilities, the equipment, the building is all better or as good as equipment and facilities that you would otherwise find at new car dealerships. We try to mimic the real world, the outside uh, repair facilities. When new equipment becomes available, updated equipment, we also update our equipment to match that. The instructors at Mercer County are very knowledgeable and are I guess for lack of a better term, very well decorated. They have lots of certifications and have been doing this for a long time. They are very knowledgeable in their trade and everything, and they help out a lot. They answer all my questions. If I don't understand something, they explain it clearly. Now I know what you guys are thinking, but what if I want to work on a different brand of cars? Now you can do that with the Comprehensive Automotive Technology Program. 
Let's take a look. Students participating in the comprehensive program will be trained in automotive technology that is not specific to any manufacturer. Comprehensive students will also be required to complete internship requirements that can be completed at any approved automotive service facility. Students will pretty much follow the same curriculum as the CAP program, but they will be able to work in other manufacturers, dealerships, as well as um, independent or franchise shops, full service facilities, uh, where we can be assured that they are learning. The automotive program is for three things in the student. The ability to work well with his or her hands, understanding theory of operation, and passion. Now, if you're one of the many people that think they can't afford to sign up for classes, financial aid and scholarships are available. The process of signing up for classes is as easy as putting gas in your car. When students come to us and they want to sign up for the program, what we do is we have them get accepted to college. It's the first step. Then the ne next step is to uh, arrange an interview day with myself and the program coordinator. At that interview, we'll sit down, we'll talk about basic interests in the automotive field, um, any kind of past experience that the student might have. Then we go ahead and we register uh, the students for the classes. The process for signing up is very easy. You should go over to Mercer County College or you can sign up online. And I told them I want to get into the automotive technology program. That's it. Let's hear from some of the graduates from the program and see what they're doing now. After, after the students graduate from Mercer Community College, they're, they're ready to go be flat rate technicians almost right away. I work for Greenfield Dodge for about a year and a half and I'm a technician. My current position is I'm Mercer County Technical School's uh, general automotive instructor for high school level students, juniors and seniors, and I'm a master automotive technician for over 20 years. To the women who are interested in fixing cars, that this is a great opportunity and they should, they should try it. And it might be tough in the beginning, you gotta prove yourself a little bit, but it'll be worth it in the end. My favorite part of the program was hands down the fact that I could work and go to school simultaneously. Uh, I could learn about things in the classroom and then go utilize that information uh, later on in the week or later in the month or bring something that I experienced at work back to the classroom and, and discuss it with the instructors and the fellow students that were in my class. I like my job because it's what I love to do. It's my lifelong dream. Fix cars. I love it. I love working with students and I love working on automobiles and I love teaching people how to do it uh, the proper way. With today's changing industry, let's see what's in store for the future of automotive technology today. We're using state-of-the-art equipment as far as scan tools, um, newer vehicles with different communication systems on. They're going to come out with fiber optic communication uh, links in these vehicles, and the students will use the professional grade equipment that's available. Cars aren't going anywhere. The need for qualified technicians is just going to grow in the future. Our goal is to have a student successful in the dealership or in the independent repair facility to where they can, they can uh, advance and grow. Past graduates now have become automotive instructors themselves. They're in management positions such as service managers, service directors, shop foremen, um, or even own their own facilities. So the opportunities, um, where you go from this program is up to you, but the opportunities are very, very strong. Offer. What are you waiting for? The opportunity is knocking.